Good morning. Hi everyone. Here we are on the sunniest island on Croatia, Hvar. We're hiking across the island to the oldest city in Croatia, Stari Grad, which is on the other side of the island. So it's about 18 kilometers. But it's about 18 kilometers, which allegedly is going to take us four short hours. I am skeptical of that, but we'll see how we go. Uh, we couldn't find this trail on any maps or uh, like Google Maps couldn't tell us where to go or anything like that. So we actually wandered around a little bit and then found the trailhead ourselves. So we'll tell you in this video where that trailhead is and exactly how to do this hike. We're spending a month here on the island of Havar, so we've been feeling a little bit cooped up in the apartment for the last couple of weeks. We've been here just over two weeks already, so uh, we're feeling pretty good about being out and heading out on a hike. just arrived in Milna. It took us about an hour and a half but that was quite like at quite a leisurely pace. Uh, we stopped to take some photos and do some video and things like that and then we got to a sign that said Starigrad 15 kilometers. So that was a kick in the nuts but <laughs> it'll be good. Um, still early enough in the day. I would like to get there by two o'clock. It's ten o'clock now um, so we'll just see how we go but yeah, it's definitely a beautiful walk. So it's really, really nice. Feels good to be walking uh, off the beaten track rather than on, you know, a road or whatever. So yeah, good day so far. So we'll see how we go. about halfway through our 18 kilometer hike and basically we're at this church which I think you can probably see behind me um, but there's a fork in the road and we're not exactly sure where to go from here. Um, we passed some friendly strangers on the way though that told us to download this app called Maps Me and it's just a map that shows you basically every road on the island like every foot road which is really cool. So we're about to check that out and just see if we can actually find out where we're supposed to go. Church of St. Vitus. Mm. Fuck, isn't that this? What? Hang on, what? Is it saying this is a cafe? No, it says that like this Church of St. Vitus is like in the middle of that town over there. Can you leave a review? Yeah. It's a right nice building. There is three different roads here each without indication of where they go. So hopefully we can find our way because we've come this far. We've got accommodation booked in Starigrad and I just don't want to have to do the walk back today. All right, so at the church, you want to take the left road. It's not marked very well. There is a marking on the tree, but it took us a long time to find it. So go to the left. And then uh, not long after that, you come across this restaurant, which we should probably find out the name it's of. Buffet Vido, Co <coughs> Vido Covac or something. So we stopped and had lunch at that beautiful restaurant, had the lamb, which was delicious. Now we are on the final stretch to Starigrad. Uh, it's supposed to take about another hour and a half. This is probably the most spectacular part of the hike so far, I'd say. You can, you can see down to the water, you can see the town of Starigrad in the distance. It's, it's just amazing. So we're excited to get there, but we're enjoying every step of it along the way.
So at long last we have made it. We're here in Starigrad, the oldest town in Croatia. It was in the end, what do you reckon, it was like 23, 23 and a half k's yeah, of hiking to get here. So this is actually the next morning. We were pretty exhausted when we got here last night. So, And we still feel a bit that way. So if we seem a little bit low energy, that's why. All right, so after a refreshing night's sleep, we have gotten up and we're about to go around and explore the city of Starograd. We went out for dinner last night, which was really nice. It just seems like a beautiful, quaint little place. Um, so we're really excited to go and check out the streets around the area. Very different to Havar so far. Um, it feels, I mean, it is a lot older, but it really feels it. So yeah, it, it's beautiful. <laughs> If you like this video please hit the thumbs up down below and don't forget to subscribe even if you don't have a YouTube account you can still subscribe with your Google account so please support us and hit subscribe and we'll see you in the next one. So uh, editing this together I realized that we didn't actually tell you where the trail is Whoops. so <laughs> we're gonna tell you that really quickly right now. Uh, we're on a road here which is the 116. Okay, so it's about a 15 minute walk from the bus slash taxi terminal. So as you come up the 116 road, you will leave Havar Town. There's the sign that you are leaving, so walk past that. Part way up the hill you will pass a strip club on the left. If you can resist going into the establishment, which we found quite hard, um, <laughs> keep going up the hill and you'll be at the trailhead shortly. Alright, so the trail starts here. We're 80 metres down from the Capito Havar campsite. And there's this big sign here, uh, which is like a map of the island. So the trail is a dirt road off to the right. Then you'll also see there's a sign here uh, with Milner, Malo, Grublia and Starigrad on it. Starigrad four hours. It's going to take you more than four hours, but that's the time it says on it. Uh, there's these red circles with white in the middle. That's what you'll be following along the trail. It's a pretty universally accepted hiking uh, symbol. So just keep following them along the trail. Sometimes they are hard to find, but they do go the whole way along. So just stick to them the whole way and you'll find your way there. Hopefully you found this video somewhat informative. Let us know if our instructions were adequate and let us know if you decide to do the hike after seeing this video. We had a really, really great time on the hike. It took us about nine and a half hours, but it was absolutely worth it. Give us a like, don't forget to subscribe and... Thanks, we'll see you in the next one. Thanks, bye. bye.